Today I am testing out a couple of Turtle Wax Hybrid Solutions products in preparation for winter. Specifically, these are the items. So we have the Hybrid Solutions Hyper Foam. This is a wheel cleaner and tire prep. It says, powerful deep cleaning foam dissolves brake dust and road contaminants easily. Wheel cleanse, tire cleanse, corrosion repellent polymer. And then we have this, the Hybrid Solutions Graphene Acrylic Tire Shine Spray Coating. So these are from the regular Hybrid Solutions range and they kind of sit beside um, and along with the Hybrid Solutions Pro products that I tested tested a while back and indeed the final thing that I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to combine them but initially I will test the hyper foam in isolation and then we'll see about combining everything and finishing off with the tire shine spray coating. So these products were introduced in 2022 along with a bunch of other products. I will put links into the description where you can go and check out those other products. So the direction that I'm going to go with this test because this is for your wheels and this is for your tires. I am going to prepare my winter wheel and tire set which have just been sitting in the garage gathering dust for months and get them ready to go onto the car because it is almost winter, it is almost time to put them onto the car. So we will get them nice and ready to go on. So this will be a very interesting product, I feel like we can use it in various different ways. The graphene acrylic tire shine, there's only really one way that we can use it and like I say we'll get to that at the end. It says deep dark gloss infused with incredible durability, repellency and UV protection. Synthetic shine polymers, graphene and acrylic polymers. So that is pretty sweet. So putting our focus then onto the Hyper Foam. This is an interesting one. It kind of sits alongside and was released at the same time as the Hybrid Solutions Pro Rapid Decon Wheel Cleaner and Iron Remover. And they're gonna do some things kind of the same, but they're not exactly the same product. Um, so this obviously being called hyperfoam the big thing about it is the fact that it foams up so essentially we can use this without needing to use a traditional snow foam so that makes it really handy and convenient and ultimately to get the maximum out of all these products we could combine these two together do a layer of this and then add our foam all around on top and the other cool thing about this is the tire prep which kind of leads into this so this is going to remove any oils any like deep in residue in the rubber and just have a nice prepared surface for our graphene acrylic tire shine and that will bond really nicely and look awesome and most importantly last for a good amount of time. So without further ado let's get started. All right, here we are then, and if I get in close, you can see just how dirty these wheels and indeed the tires are. So we are going to start off, I'm gonna start off with these two wheels right here. This one I am going to do completely contactless. So I'm going to get a good amount of our hyper foam around the wheel and the tire wall. And then on this one, I will do the same, but then I will agitate it. So I'll use a barrel brush and I will use a detailing brush to get in and around and then I will rinse them both off after they've been on for a while and we will see the differences. Okay so I've opened the nozzle here we go. So instant foaming very thick very clingy foam look at that that's not even like dripping that is very very cool. All right, so what I'm seeing instantly is you can see the reaction here. Um, it is bubbling away and you can see that sort of brownness that is being pulled out of the tire there. Don't know if you can hear, but it's kind of like fizzing. That's pretty cool. But yeah, you can definitely see it going to work on the tire. That's very, very noticeable indeed. Um, so yeah. Same thing on this one initially, like I said. Just trying to get in there into the barrel. 
So I'll start off with my detailing brush, getting into these crevices. And also actually on the tire wall itself. So just as I'm doing this, I can talk about um, how it smells. So anything that has iron fallout remover typically smells pretty bad, but this doesn't smell too bad. You can tell that it's there, um, but Turtle Wax have done a great job in masking it. So that's pretty good. All right, so let's say we are ready to move over to barrel brush. And with that, we are ready to rinse off. Okay, so initial thoughts, initial impressions are we have definitely removed a lot of dirt um, from both wheels and tires, um, both contactless and contact. So um, it was probably difficult to see in that, but whilst I was rinsing off, like the water was basically like brown. Um, it was pretty nasty. So it's definitely lifting off a good amount of dirt. I mean, I can see in here, um, this one being the contact I mean, I can see that there is still some persistent dirt, especially in the barrels. Um, so I would say, you know, this looks reasonably good. Obviously, I haven't like dried it off, but it looks reasonably good and a decent amount of dirt did come off. So, you know, if you're if you're strapped for time, this would be a good option. But ultimately, if I jump over here. We don't have the same, um, which is obviously much better. And yeah, it didn't really take too much effort. Um, it really did sort of feel like it was dissolving the dirt, that sort of fizziness. And um, yeah, like I say, I haven't obviously dried off, but we are looking pretty good. But one interesting thing that I did want to point out um, that I hadn't even really thought too much about until I was reading the packaging earlier on. You can see here that we have some beading and that is down to the protection. There's like a, so there's a very light layer of protection being added added in this product so it's almost like an, a bit of an all-in-one uh, which I wasn't really even considering I thought I was going to have to go and jump and add my own protection on top which I probably will ultimately do as well because um, it's like not like loads of beading you know the water isn't like flying off it or anything but it is adding a bit of something so I would say it's a really good first step as part of a wider detailing solution as an all-in-one it is potentially very very useful again if you are strapped for time and in terms of the tire um, that is looking very very nice indeed you can see that it just like looks really clean it just looks fresh if I compare that to the contactless you know the contactless you know has done a pretty good job actually I must say on the tire um, almost don't even have to touch it probably has done a bit of a better job here um, so again Decent contactless, but with contact, you're gonna get an even better job. So yeah, that is the Hyperfoam, but what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to move on and do what I think is like gonna be the ultimate in preparation of these wheels and tires for the winter period. So I'm gonna start with the Hybrid Solutions Pro Rapid Decon. I am going to get a layer on there. Then I will grab the Hyperfoam and I will concentrate the Hyperfoam on the tires because I think it did a remarkably good job on the tires and use then just a traditional snow foam on top of everything. I will agitate the hard to reach areas and then I will rinse off and then I will do a traditional contact clean and I'll show you what I'm using for that once I get there. So the reason why I am doing the two different wheel cleaners um, and using them in different ways, um, the spray, the Hyper Solutions Pro spray can really like project itself in and around all of the corners and stuff which isn't quite so easy with the foam um, whereas then the foam really seems to stick to the rubber real nice and just goes to work i mean i only just put that on look at go um so yeah i think it's just a really really good combination if indeed you have the option of using both at the same time
All right, so I would call that like the conclusion of like, you know, the pre-wash or the decontamination. So now we'll move on to a regular sort of contact clean using Hybrid Solutions Pro Slick and Slide. So just using this as a normal shampoo and I'm going to be using a noodle knit. Right, nice looking great. So that is the contact clean done, apart from drying of course, on two of them. So I'll just repeat that exact same process for the other two and then we will get to drying. Alrighty, looking great. So now I will dry with a good quality drying towel. Alright, so that's one looking lovely, nice and dry, ready for some coatings. So I will just repeat the exact same with the rest. Alright, now we are clean, we are dry. So I'm going to top up or add a bit of protection now. And I'm going to do that in a very quick, easy step using a Turtle Wax Hybrid Solutions product from a while ago, but is still a great product. And it's this, the Hybrid Solutions Ceramic Acrylic Black Wax. So this is a spray on wipe off product. It adds ceramic and acrylic protection and it is pigmented black which works well for the black wheels so I'm gonna do that now I've got the product I've got two cloths so I'm gonna spray on wipe it around the wheel and then I am going to buff off with the other one I figure I might as well go straight on to the last part before I do the rest of the wheels there. And that is the Hybrid Solutions Graphene Acrylic Tire Shine Spray Coating. So the acrylic in here is kind of matching it together with the product line that we just used for adding our protection, except of course this is for the tires. So I have my Old Faithful sponge for applying tire shine. So I'm gonna spray it into the sponge and then use the sponge to move it around the tire. There we are then, that was quick, easy and painless. And I must say, it's really nice level of tire shine without being like ridiculous, like an oil slick. It's like a little bit beyond satin, um, but look how well it brings out the Bridgestone logo there. That's really awesome. And yeah, as far as application goes, like I say, it was really quick and really easy. I didn't have to reapply to this at all. One application into my sponge did the entire tire. With your normal sort of tire shine, I typically find myself constantly reapplying to the sponge, wiping a bit, reapplying, wiping a bit. So that is awesome. That is a really, really good job. And it smells nice too, which obviously you can't really tell through the camera. So yes, this is the final form. This is what I consider to be fully ready for winter, fully prepped and looking awesome thanks to all of the Turtle Wax products. So all I have to do now is repeat the application of my coatings on the other three wheels and then I will be winter ready. There we are then, all done and ready for winter.
Well, there we are then. That is the winter prep on my winter wheels and tires done. Utilizing the products from the Turtle Wax Hybrid Solutions range. And I must say, I am very, very happy with the outcome. I think the results really do speak for themselves. Everything worked exactly as it was supposed to. Everything was just so nice and easy and simple to do and to use. I really love all of them. And the two products that I have never used before, the Hyper Foam and the Tire Shine, I must say I am very, very impressed. The Hyper Foam really does foam really well. It's thick, it clings, and you can see it doing the job that it says it will do, and that is awesome. And the Tire Shine, not too shiny, like not offensively shiny, but makes the tires look so so good and it goes on really easy without needing to continually reapply so a little bit goes a long way and that is awesome so i am very happy with the results i'm very happy with all of these turtle wax products a big thank you to them for sending them out to me and i hope you like the results too and i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching please do like share and subscribe for more content to come very very soon thank you once again goodbye